So my husband has been working for a few days now to get this little room cleared out with me and look he has gotten some bright white paint to put in here and he just got my chandelier put up. I'm so excited. He bought this as a surprise for me. He saw me looking at it at Home Depot and I told him the other night, I was like, I really like that chandelier. And he was like, the chandelier I already got for you as a surprise. I was like, you did? Look at that rusty black that was in there. No. I'm so excited to get this set up today. Yes, I've been out here spray painting with that pink spray. This is my first time spray painting a piece of furniture, but so far it's turning out pretty well. I mean, the pink is coming through after I primed it with that white paint, so I'm happy with it. All right, you guys, welcome to my tiny office. And this is how it looks with just my little fairy lights on. And then I'll go ahead and turn some additional lighting on that my husband installed for me. And this is just some little LED lights that are battery operated, but it has a switch so I can just hit that and then it lights up a little bit more. Like if I'm in here at night and I just want a soft light to do some journaling or something. And then he installed this gorgeous chandelier for me. So let me turn that on for you guys. And there we go. So you saw the before. So let's just walk in and I'll show you around. So I got this little shelf right here from TJ Maxx. And I just fell in love with it. It's just so pretty to me. It's elegant and I really like the gold. My theme in here was gold and like a soft pink. So most of the decor I kind of put together. Some of it was things I already had around the house and some things I just bought specifically for my office. I really enjoy these little containers to put my glitters in because it helps me organize them better and see what I have. I'm one of those people that I like to have things out because I forget what I have. This little love sign was also from Home Goods. The little pink and gold boxes up there, I have a bunch of those. And you can see these up here. I'm going to be using those for storage as well as these. So this desk I actually ordered from Joss and Maine. And what I did was I took the measurements in here before so that we would know what we were ordering. And I'm really happy with it. It actually came in one piece and then my husband just had to put the legs on it so that was like super easy and then what I did was I went and I got some plexiglass at Home Depot and I had my husband go pick it up they cut it for you for free I think this piece was about $22 so that worked out really well it gives the desk a more durable finish I can sit you know a cup on there without worrying about messing up the desk or if I'm doing an art project or glue or markers or something I don't have to, you know, be so panicked about the white and possibly messing up the paint. So I really am happy with the desk. The little drawer that's in here just slides out, but it also folds down. And I'll do a desk tour for you guys and like my organization stuff later. But I just wanted to show you what I have so far. I decided my, my daughter has a different one of these and she said, Mommy, you can just keep that for your office because it's the same colors that I already had. So I kept this in here and used it for a washi tape organizer. And then there's my little DIY cookie sheet for my magnet board. And I've got one other thing that I'm going to make as well for in here. And then this little rack I also got from Home Goods. I think this was about $12. I have two of them, but I wasn't sure exactly how things would fit. I think that if I put another one underneath it, it might be a little bit too cluttered. And these are just folders and things I've been picking up lately at the Dollar Tree and Target Dollar Spot. And then I already showed, I have this in my DIY video also of this ribbon holder that I made. And this is super easy. This costs like a few dollars to make. <laughs> now this piece here is actually from Michaels and they had these um, for 50% off of all their organization things and then I just put a little decor on the side of it with some stickers and things that I have just because it went with my decor and I thought it would look better. This piece here is actually a wrapping paper organizer and I picked this up right after Christmas also. I think this was $5.99 on clearance and I bought this at TJ Maxx. I think it has pockets on the back too but I just hung it here because I can put all kinds of stuff in there. I have my cutting board in here 
And then these are just wraps that I like to have for like birthdays and stuff. There's a few holiday wraps that I kept in there. This one would be nice for weddings or something like that. But I like to have that stuff nearby. This little chest here was actually black. And so I primed it and I just spray painted it. Because these baskets, they looked white in the store next to the black. But actually they're more of a cream color. And I didn't want it to clash too much. So I think it looks much better now that it's pink. And then these little tags that are on here are actually from the Target Dollar Spot. They're just little gift tags, but I'm going to label these for what I'm going to put in each drawer. This I picked up in the after clearance items. And this was from Michael's. I just put batteries in it to see what it was going to look like. And it is super bright. The only thing I don't like about it is it's kind of a yellowish light. So <laughs> that's a little bit much for me, but I might like it sometimes at night. That's if my daughter doesn't take it from me. <laughs> and of course, this is the piece that I picked up at Target recently in their dollar spot. So I just put a few little items in there. I'm going to be putting magnets on the back of these, I think, to use on my magnet board. And then you guys already saw this little canister here I picked up from Target. And this actually is a container that something else came in but I love the way that it looked with these straws inside so I went ahead and put those for in. all the DIYs that I have in here I will link those below so you guys can check out that video in case you haven't seen it and hopefully I'm not walking too fast for you guys but once again here is my office that we made out of a closet thanks for stopping by my channel hope to see you again soon bye bye Thank <laughs> you.